What's up people, today I'm gonna show you a freeware easy to use photo editing software called Photoscape. So first of all just search it up on Google and download it. It's freeware and anyone can download it. And after downloading just install it and you will have this icon on your desktop. So let's double click that and open up Photoscape. And as you can see there are a lot of features in this software. There's editor, badge editor, page, animated GIF, a lot of stuff but this is just going to be an overview and not a detailed tutorial so I'll just go ahead and click on editor right here and drag and drop the photo that you want to work on simple as that now as you can see there are a lot of things a lot of settings here and first of all we'll check out the home tab the first tab and firstly we have some color changing options right here like clicking on this thing will make it black and white clicking on this will invert the colors then we have some frames right here a lot of beautiful frames to choose from then we have some other settings right here like sharpness filter backlight and all, the, all the good stuff and as you can see how dramatically it changes the photo then we have some other settings right here and after that we have the color curves right here and it can really help us make the photo look better it can help us in color correction so you can really play around with the settings here and as you can see it really puts a real effect on the appearance of the photograph after that we have the second tab called object which is mainly about text so just to add text uh, click on this and type in your text and change the color from here and choose your font from here that's it then click OK and you can resize it and place it wherever you want to place it and really easy to remove as well just click on this little cross right here then we have some animated things that we can add like like here we have some clouds raining clouds right here which we can add into the photograph put it right here or anywhere then we have the photo we can add a photograph over this photograph that we are working on just browse the photo and double click on that and there you go you have the photo on the previous photo that you were working on and really simply you can just place it anywhere you can like so after that we have the third tab called crop and as the name suggests it's all about just cropping the photo this is free crop then we have some ratios right here like this is one by one the, this can be really helpful while cropping an image then we have the third tab called tools and the first thing is red eye correction you know sometimes people have red eyes due to the flash fight by the camera so this can help correct that then we have the second thing called mole removal sometimes people have some scars or marks on the face those things can be removed by this tool then we have mosaic it can help us blur out something from the image like someone's face some text or anything like this house here can be blurred out like so really simple then we have paint brush which is just like any paint brush like paint or Photoshop or anything then we have clone stamp which is another great tool as you can see it clones the area from one place to another so this these are some simple features there are a lot of them but we cannot discuss them in detail right now because there will be a long tutorial and these are some basic controls so that is Photoscape for you it is not very complicated really simple and anyone can use it basically and to save the photo just click on save save again and here you can select the decide the quality then click OK and your photo is saved it replaces the original photo and saves 
the original photo in a folder called originals so really helpful so that is photoscape for you really simple and easy to use thanks a lot for watching and have a great day